This is one of my favorite pictures that I'm going to get tattooed. As I said, I'm just uh, going to walk you through drawing up. There you just... I'm tracing the moth right there. I'm going to get this tattooed on me one day. The original blue picture, but... Anyway, this is how you do digital art. Online. Not online, but on your iPad. Like digital painting and stuff. And then I'm just... Going about... I'm going to use a different... There we go. I think that might be it. No. There. There we go. And then I use a spongy thing. Which is in red. Anything in red is what I'm using. This is derived from one of my favorite pictures that I saw on Tumblr and wanted to uh, bring this out to the world. Now I'm going back to finger painting, as I call it. Sorry for the chestnut flag there, folks. I'm just doing... This is going to be a little... It's going to be spectacular in the end. Just wait. It took me 12 minutes or so to make this. So this is pretty good. There, I had to zoom out to get the antennae. So this is how you draw over or superimpose over a imported picture. Now we go to decorating the moth. There we go. The signature black dot. Then we get the body and uh, some of the highlights and lowlights. Okay, I missed, missed stuff on that. Here we go. There's some of the highlights and lowlights. Now on to, I think this is going to go on to the finger now. And I'm not talking about this finger. I'm talking about the finger in the actual picture. So I'm doing some highlights and lowlights there as well. I have done three of these out of the same picture, but different aspects of the picture. This is the thumb. I did the pointer in the middle and then the ring and the pinky as well. It, this is great for Halloween if you ever want to look at this. It's on my uh, my links are on my space hey which are um, Karma T music. Usually I would do music videos, but in this case I was doing this instead. And this is my low, my highlights of the finger. Or the thumb, actually. This app is called Sketch. Tatsumi or Tatsui Sketch. I don't know what I really want to call it. And anyway, here we go. We're going to go to the low lights. Which is a shadow, and then I'm going to show you the best part, this part. Uh, I might tell you that the ending is good, but it's very disturbing looking, so this might not be... Yeah, there we go. Here comes the blood. I'm making a flesh-eating moth out of the picture, so that's good. And there we go, Joe.
just making the bloody part of the finger or thumb. I guess I can do both. Uh, I'm doing the paintbrush there. Anyway, I can do uh, music videos and art on this anyway, so... This should be interesting. Now I'm getting the necrotic flesh and the blood. Using a spongy part, not a spongy part, but a watercolory part. And then I go and brighten it, uh, brighten up. So I can make blood droplets. And the background, I hate to blow the picture of the picture, will be actually black with some gray around it to signify night because moths usually come out at night. I've done this before with my own um, actual uh, face, only not gory uh, with rainbow colors. Now here we go, we're going to smear it pretty soon. I th oh wait, we're getting this part done. Not that it really matters, but it matters to me. This took me 12 minutes in full for each two fingers, or in this case, this one was the thumb. Sorry for the hairy eyeball there, people. I'm just saying this is me filling out the background. There we go. See that I changed it from a blue aesthetic to a real life aesthetic. And we're still at the uh, bloody, uh, uh, no pun intended, but the actual um, background, which is a pain in my ass. Excuse my French people, but that's what it is, a pain in my rectum. It's becoming less of a pain right now as I'm feeling it in. You gotta watch out for Zen mode when you do this because then you get screwed over big time. Still doing the background. Tertiary background, but still. Any imperfections will be smeared, and just as you know. Let's see where we're at. Okay, we're getting there. This is definitely going to be a greatest hits. And now we get the spray gun. There we go, Joe. 
Now here's where I'm a samurai. Smudging. You use a tortilla-like thing that's in red. And then let me see what I'm doing here. Oh, the antenna. I'm starting off at the moth. I don't know where I'm going to now, but I am smudge smearing or smudging. Oh, I'm after the blood now. As I said, this took me quite a while. Almost the whole morning. I was going to write the morning, but or re watch Yakuza films. No pun intended with the bloody finger, but I was going to watch Yakuza films, and then I got ADHD mode, and then I ended up having to... Let's see what's being smeared next. I just had to. Okay. Just seeing what's being uh, smeared now. We got the background. Uh, I think the moth should get smeared up a little. Now I'm doing my name. There you go. 